Born in 1931 to a wealthy, prominent Jewish family outside Boston, Richard Alpert was the youngest of three boys. Precocious, and everyone agreed, the star of the family. At 27, Richard was an assistant professor of psychology at Harvard University and had all trappings of big success. A corner office, golf outings, extravagant vacations. In 1959, a young professor named Timothy Leary moved into the office next door. He was brilliant, charismatic, and believed mind-expanding psychedelic drugs could be used in psychological treatment, a theory that also intrigued Richard Alpert. One of the dramatic characteristics of the psychedelic experience is you start to have this dissociative experience of where all that you become is awareness, is a point of awareness, that's all that's left. The professors tested this theory on students and were famously fired from Harvard for their research in 1963. That's when Richard realized he needed to follow an entirely different path to enlightenment. And it led him to India. It was there he met Maharaji, who became his guru, or spiritual guide, and taught him the power of unconditional love. Richard returned to Boston, renamed Ram Das, which means servant of God, with a new sense of purpose, to teach a generation a lesson he learned in the East, to live in the moment. I am without form, without limit, beyond space, beyond time. And he wrote his classic best-selling book, Be Here Now. Over the next two decades, he decided to dedicate his life to serving others, continued writing, and taught around the world. Take a deep breath. In 1997, at 65, Ram Das suffered a massive stroke. Doctors gave him a 10% chance of survival. But Ram Das is still here, and his message as strong as ever. So on a magnificent Maui day, with the Pacific Ocean as our backdrop, I met Ram Das for the first time in his own backyard. 